So on this website, if I scroll a little, then you can see a sticky header appears up. So this kind of functionality you have seen on many websites. And today we are going to understand the logic behind this intermediate level functionality. Welcome to the sixth video of real world JavaScript series. So here we will use the document dot add event listener and event is going to be of type DOM content loaded. It will trigger one function. And here we will create one variable that is a sticky header. And here we will pass our element grabbed using cat element by ID that is a sticky header. Now let's take a look on the HTML part. So here we have the code for this header where ID is a sticky header and our header code is written over here. And one more thing, the GitHub repository link is present inside the description of this video in case you need this code. Now in JavaScript, our next step will be adding this event listener that is of type scroll. And here we will write some condition. And for this, we are going to use the window global object and it has some property that is a scroll Y. And if it goes greater than 100 pixels in the Y direction, if we scroll more than 100 pixels, then what we are doing here, here we are adding the class list visible to it. So in our CSS, I have written this class. So it will add this top zero. That's why our sticky header appears up. And how we are making the header sticky by using this code that is position fixed and all the other properties are written over here. Now we will add here else condition and it will remove the visible class from here. And now it is the time to take a look on our UI. But before that, I request you to share this video with your friends and definitely do not forget to like this video. So here is our UI. 